Ukraine or our business plan, uh, <coughs> then uh, Federico Marchetti launched uh, Mute.com. Uh, and uh, this um, has uh, been the same basically through the years. I mean, it has clear ideas, clear objectives, uh, the innovation has like, never changed. Um, Luke's group, uh, for uh, who doesn't know what we do, we have uh, two different uh, line of business. Uh, one is what we call it multi brand, so we have uh, um, online stores uh, like Luke's.com, thecorner.com and it just launched shoescribe.com. Uh, and then we have a mono brand business, meaning that uh, we power um, the e-commerce for uh, 32 uh, online stores. Uh, so we take care of uh, the, for those brands, uh, from the warehouse uh, to the customer care, uh, to the sites, uh, to the assortments, uh, everything basically. So it's a real partnership. Um, today, uh, you know, I've put together some examples of some, uh, you know, tips uh, maybe that uh, we can share, um, and also some trends that we have seen, uh, you know, through the years. Of course, uh, this is, uh, you know, something that uh, if you are there first, uh, that's a, a very strong competitive advantage. We were there in 2000 with Bits.com, so 12 years now. Then in 2006, we launched our monobrand business. 2008, we launched the first men uh, website, thecorner.com. Then we were the first one to enter China in uh, 2010 with Armani, and uh, uh, now other brands are there with us, and also the corner is there. And then uh, the last venture that I'm going to explain a little bit the business model um, behind uh, the last um, venture. Uh, even though we are a global player, we really believe in uh, local expertise. Uh, meaning that uh, we deliver to over 100 <coughs> countries. But uh, in the main countries we have local presence, meaning from the warehouse to the local customer service, uh, the websites are localized, the payment systems are localized. So we're global but really acting uh, locally. Um, and that's, that's a key for us. Some trend that uh, we have been observing lately is that not only um, customers want to um, see the fashion show, you know, through the streaming, but they want to be able now to reserve directly from the show, basically the next collection. Meaning that they want to buy the collection even before it gets to the store. Uh, and that's becoming more and more uh, popular. Another one uh, is exclusivity. <coughs> you know, they look for big brands, they look for, uh, you know, different assortments, but also they want capsule collection. They want something exclusive, limited edition, kind of done for them. Um, another trend is the social responsibility. Um, in 2009, we launched this Uxygen, which is an area, a permanent area on ux.com, where we collect all the eco-friendly initiatives. Uh, uh, so all brands that basically are eco-friendly, with the produce eco-friendly uh, products. And that's another trend that is uh, growing pretty fast. Um, so I'm not going to go through the different platforms because uh, we've seen you know, the importance of being uh, you know, there on all, you know, platforms, from, from mobile to iPad to all the applications. What I want to focus on is more on customer service because lately this is where we really invested the resources and time uh, to innovate in this area. Um, so one example is in China. As I said, localization for us is very important. So we have uh, dedicated customer care. Um, and we have local website. We um, did an exclusive package, luxury packaging for just for China. But we went uh, even further, meaning that uh, we came up with this butler service. Um, so the fact that guy wait uh, for the customer when delivered the product, the customer can try on what um, he or she got, and then uh, you know if he doesn't fit, can give it back directly to the FedEx guy. Um, and also we have developed uh, uh, the un uh, an anti fraud system because in China, I mean that's a big problem. Uh, so it's a technology that allows us to know basically if uh, when they return um, the garments basically you know they, they are counterfeit or they are like the real um, garments. Uh, we just as um, I mentioned before, we just launched shoescribe.com, which is a vertical website dedicated <coughs> to women's shoes and everything that surrounds surrounds them. 
Um, and for that, we have decided really to bring forward uh, this service. Uh, meaning that, uh, for example, uh, we have built a dedicated shoe box with a window <coughs> so that where, you know, they can see the shoes that they buy. Or the uh, labels that they can print out from, <coughs> uh, um, from the site uh, with the design of the shoe that they can then put on the, on the box. Uh, we also have created uh, uh, the shoe ballet, meaning that uh, it's um, a list of cobblers in uh, every in the major cities <coughs> that we recommend, basically, uh, and they can go there and get discount or special treatment. Uh, this is just as an example of London, and so we're doing this for the major cities. Um, and then also uh, Miss uh, Susie Scribe. Uh, which is a shoe guru um, where users can ask questions, advice, and always available 24 hours. And then for uh, um, whoever is really passionate about shoes, uh, there is also an annual uh, subscription um, that they can buy and they get the extra additional service uh, from the free shipping for a year uh, to the, um, the shoe repair for free. So they can send the shoes to these cobblers and then uh, uh, the cobblers will make them back fixed. Uh, the private line that they can call, and uh, also Cinderella for a day, meaning that the day of your birthday uh, will give you uh, one shoe for free. Fifty percent discount, just <laughs> make it more glamorous. I would say. Um, so I'm going really fast just because I'm uh, aware of uh, the timing. Um, of course, to make this, uh, you know, all this happen and make it work, we invested massively in technology, in the backbones. Um, so the warehouse, our warehouse is completely automated, and it's the only way that where we can, uh, you know, we have to power 35 stores basically, um, and every store is different and offering a different service. So to be able to do that, of course, we had to invest massively uh, there. Um, in fact, in 2011, um, I mean, we 99% of deliveries were on time. So it's um, you know quite a big a target for us uh, that we were able to reach. Uh, and of course, uh, another big investment was on the platform, meaning that we have uh, one platform for all the stores. Uh, is scalable and reliable. Uh, it, has, uh, it has to accommodate multi-brand, but also the mono-brand business as well. Um, it needs to be, since uh, we strongly believe in localization, it needs to be um, easy to accommodate different languages, like the Chinese, the Russian, so very you know, different from Italian, uh, English, etc. Um, and also it's multi-channel. So meaning that you know it is then easy to have everything available uh, in all the devices.